11 huge Emmerdale spoilers for next week. What's next in the village? 1. Chaz rocks the family. Gathering the family, Chaz reveals that the cause of her cancer is the faulty BRCA2 gene. She informs Kane, Caleb and Aaron that they might have it too. Kane and Caleb also learn that they could have passed it on to their children. 2. Aaron is uneasy. As Chaz goes to see Mandy for her birthday, she urges Aaron to make an appointment for his gene test. But Aaron is uncomfortable and evasive in the face of Chaz's mounting pressure. 3. Ruby and Caleb argue. As a huge fight brews, Kane intervenes and tries to move the confrontation outside, but Ruby refuses and knees Kane in the groin. Mortified Chaz heads to the back room, where she's supported by friends and hopes for the best chance at surviving her diagnosis. 4. Rona's court case causes stress. Tensions run high at Smithy Cottage as Rona's court case looms and it's clear that it's worrying everyone, including April. Unable to brand herself a criminal, Rona tells her family she'll be pleading not guilty. 5. April visits Gus. April skips school, visiting Gus instead. Determined to change Rona's fortunes, April confronts Gus and begs him to tell the police that Rona is innocent. But April accidentally puts her foot in it by revealing Rona is pleading not guilty. Gus drops her home but a huge argument breaks out. 6. Marlon fights with Gus. Gus is furious at Rona's plea decision. When Rona moves to see Ivy, a tussle breaks out between Marlon and Gus and Gus ends up injured on the ground. He refuses to accept Marlon's apology and April runs off, worried she has made things worse. 7. Gus gives Rona a choice. Later on, Rona is taken aback when Gus suggests they both change their statements and aim for not guilty verdicts. Softening, Gus bargains and suggests if Rona agrees he'll give her access to Ivy and cancel his house move. Will Rona trust Gus enough to agree to the pact? 8. Tom goes cold. When Belle gets given a job opportunity by Susie, Tom won't talk to his new wife. Later he admits he told Angelica that Belle would speak to her about her experience in the secure children's home. When Belle is hesitant about talking to Angelica, Tom makes her feel terrible and so she agrees. 9. Belle's kindness backfires. As Angelica worries about experiencing the same mental health problems as Belle and gets upset, Jimmy discovers both women crying and lectures Belle, who runs away. Devastated Belle looks for reassurance from Tom, who denies encouraging her to speak to Angelica, but twists the situation when he promises to protect her. 10. Jimmy and Nicola worry. With Angelica's punishment looming, Jimmy and Nicola worry their little girl isn't prepared enough for a spell in the secure children's home. How will her distraught parents cope when she finally leaves and faces the consequences of accidentally killing Heath? 11. Susie and Vanessa flirt. Now back in the village for good, Vanessa's keen to rekindle things with her ex-girlfriend, Susie. Next week the pair share a flirtatious moment in the Woolpack. But will they decide they've got something worth restarting?